All right, looks like we're good. Everything is recording. I think the mic's in the right place. I think it's on. It'd be really awkward if it wasn't because that would be <laughs> un unpleasant and completely believable because it's me. I've done that. So yeah, we're just going to jump right in. Hi right, everyone, I'm Marrier, and today we're going to be doing more Genshin Impact. I'm actually just a bit of ways into the main quest. I don't actually know how far I am in. Um, I accidentally talked to Childe, Childe, Child, however you say his name, and finished the last chain, but I start up the next one without doing anything. An organization known as, I'm going to butcher this, Wang Sheng. Wang Sheng? Wang Sheng? I'm probably butchering the name horribly. I'm assuming I just said something insulting without realizing it. I need to talk to the bank staff. While I was doing that, though, I was just randomly screwing around, and, um, I kind of landed on this, let's go with boat, that's very gaudy. Has a freaking spinning fan thing? Yeah, the things you can do with Venti. I haven't explored the top of those cliffs yet. Yeah, so there's a quest here that lands on it, and you trigger it, and I gotta talk to people. I'm not gonna do that, because I have no idea if I was supposed to do this yet. So we're gonna ignore that. I'm also gonna jump right in, and just put this down, do the thing. Also, if it's too loud, too quiet, let me know in the chat. E. Alright. I think we're good. Noise. Alright, so let's see. I need to get back there. Huh. Counterpoint. I'm going to do this. Or, or not. I guess I'm not going to do this. Hmm. Brace yourself. Yes. And I, I can't land on it. I legitimately cannot land on it. Okay. Wow. <sighs> well, I already stole all the shit they had here. I might as well leave. I'm kind of annoyed I had to get their shit. So we're going to try flying. I do not think this will work. Yeah, all signs point to I'm going to die. I'm going to die horribly. I'm going to die horribly while staring at a little boy's ass. A little boy who is technically probably hundreds, if not thousands, of years old. Huh, I did not think this through. So if we go really slow, I, do I have enough stamina? I have been following the guides on where to find all the A Oculus, so I finished that off. And then I was... Too lazy to do the uh, Geo Oculus ones. God, that's a weird word to say. Yeah. Also, for everyone in the chat, sup? Esme, Andrew, Star, ooh, Salazar, Tudor, sup? I cannot pronounce anything, but I recognize it's Korean language. Cool, things are dropping in. Ooh, KR555 Wizard. Ooh, his name. Venti kind of fits the ledge. Yeah, he's kind of awesome that way. <laughs> oh man, there's a lot of people here. Wallace, and sup? I feel the pot of root coming. Oh god. No one starts singing Hashira Sare, y'all. Oh god, I'm starting to do it. No, no, it's not even Thanksgiving yet. Why am I already in the Potteroo? There's a channel on my Discord of nothing but Potteroo. It's been active all year and now it's going to explode. Oh god, there's a lot of people here. George, sup? Ooh, T, sup? And the first person was. Oh, it looks like. Ooh, reach. Did I actually make it? I actually made it while I wasn't even paying attention. I was expecting to die. Huh. The more you know. I I'm okay with this. Oh, uh... Blue Bolt Bomber, why is Saber in the thumbnail? Because I found it funny. Like, literally all the sure, thumbnails for Genshin I do, it's two, literally just my excuse to make memes. Apple. Is it a good excuse? No, but I'm doing it anyways. <laughs> I'm easily <laughs> amused. Okay, that's not a new empty. Yes, we get it. You like gliding. You say it every five minutes I use you. <sighs> if you weren't so damn good and also kind of an amazing character, I would not use you. But damn you for being a good character and actually very useful in this fight. He checks off all the boxes you need. Now, if only they had more of the... Uh, 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 what was that sound? Did I get a... No, no, it's just the things coming into range. Ah, I got excited. It's like, ooh, there's a Geoculus. I can get more of the orbs. You get more stamina and do stuff. Nope. Nope. All the... Nope. There's nothing going on there. The fuck was that? Okay, seriously, I, I'm not the only one who saw that, right? Ha, adventurer, think you can last a round against me? Uh, it. What? 
what just happened? Why did that just appear? How did that just appear? What did I do to trigger that? I'm not complaining, but I, I don't understand. What did I do? Like, are there just random puzzles that you just have to run around in here to get stuff? I... <laughs> and my wife just chimed in. Yeah. Oh, she's adorable. I... Okay. Yeah, that was a thing. Why does it... It's like every time one of the little map markers goes off. Uh, I, I just... But maybe if I jump up there, I'll get something else. I'm a jump in a tree. Oh shit, I fell. Seriously? I meant to jump, but okay, that works. Wasn't there a lady up here? Okay, they teleport. Kitty! Oh, now there's a quest? That wasn't there five minutes ago, was it? Seriously, these like little random quests just pop up all the time. I try and do them all when I can. When will work resume? When you get more? Usually that's how it goes. Oh yeah, I saw the forge. It's kind of cool setup. Looks like they're going to expand it whenever they finally get around to adding more territory. Hmm. If you have the time, traveler, could you go to the chasm and help me investigate? If there really is nothing serious happening, I can appeal to the Ministry of Civil Affairs that work be resumed. I've been there. There's monsters everywhere. She'd die if you bring her. You're a horrible father. Oh, the forge. Never mind. That place was safe. I thought they said the chasm. <laughs> I, just I want a new toy. Smile. <sighs> Coffee is awesome. What should I try this time? <laughs> so now I got Honey. the thing to do. I'm not gonna do that though. It's like, hey, you want me to help you out? I'm gonna wait a few weeks. Because you didn't pay me up front. That's your own fault. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna do this thing where I was gonna fly in with Venti. Like, just drop in, dive bomb, try to knock Chile off a ledge. But I then remembered, oh yeah, he's not here anymore. I don't know why, something about him strikes me as a little uh, murdery. Maybe it's because he's a Fatui. And generally, when you have an organization whose name sounds like you're spitting a loogie, yeah. It's like if you named your organization Fart. Why? You, you just choose a child... Hello, Vlad. You impaled people. Ah, I just had a squirrel moment. I realized that. God. Goodbye. That is the nicest thing I could say to one of you people. What do I mean by you people? I mean people who I'm obviously eventually going to have to kill. It's kind of their thing. Also, with how they're setting it up, we're supposed to make trips to all the gods. We'll have to talk to the Fatui's murder god sometime. The ice murder god. Yeah. Ooh, Andrew, you're eating Hawaiian fries, rice with egg. Oh, God, that sounds amazing. Ooh, Wallace, the free four-star in FGO, I didn't actually use it yet. I saw it. I didn't choose because I can't tell if I want to do Valkyrie or maybe uh, Atlanta Berserker. I, I honestly don't know. Both are good options. Oh, Ekaterina. Welcome, friend of child. And congratulations oh, on the child. first day of your illustrious career with the Fatui. What? What was that? So we either get to say no to being a friend of Childe or no to join the Fatui. Oh! Why can't there just be an option of the fuck? Because I have like the the fuck option right now. I think it gets most of my basic everything across. You sound remarkably sure of yourself. Uh -huh. Remember, we are mere mortals. Our ideas are fluid like water. Only the Tsaritsa truly has a will as solid as the permafrost. That melts! But back to the matter at hand. Child tells me that he has God, upheld his end idea. of your agreement. Oh yeah, he did. What agreement? We had an agreement? Oh, the thing about him helping us find a guy? Correct. Child promised he would find someone to break the stalemate. And the Harbingers do not break their promises lightly. Crap, that was his end of the bargain. Uh, where is that guy anyway? Child is currently at Leoli Pavilion. Oh yeah, I think I was there. Doing a thing. Oh, oh, Paimon knows this one. Yeah, we did it for the other quest already. <clears throat> there are two styles 
of cooking in Liyue, known as Li style and Yue style. They have been competing for centuries, but neither has emerged as the clear winner. How does Paimon know so many things and yet know so little about others? It's not that she knows everything about one thing. It's like random things. She'll be like, oh, I don't know what this is. And I'm like, but this is something obvious. But then it's like random cooking styles for centuries. No, she knows all of that. It doesn't bug me that she knows it or that she doesn't. It's that it's inconsistent. That bugs me. That bugs me a lot. The flagship restaurant of the Lee style is the Li Li Pavilion. Mm. The owner especially chose to open the restaurant at Feiyuan Slope so they could compete face to face with the Xinyue Kiosk, which is the flagship restaurant of the Yue style. She's very motivated by food and treasure. Dear God, she's practically a main character in her own right. Hmm. Every time we talk about food. Don't talk to Paimon <laughs> like that. Anyway, Paimon's hungry. Let's God. get moving. Flying apparently takes a lot of energy. Wish we could do that. But we can't. Welcome there we'll to the Earthly. Northland Bank. I have no idea how long this quest goes for. So, Toto, she knows almost everything food-related. Oh, God, I actually empathize with that. Like, no lie, it's something I completely empathize with. It's like, oh, wow, food, yay! <laughs> so, Chavez, you say it's a little sus? Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, it's not like she just randomly attacked us or murdered us or anything. Yep. Ignoring the fact that she's uh, not the Kiana XP in the beginning of the game. Also, if anyone doesn't realize, uh, Kiana is a character from the previous MiHoYo game, Genshin, or not Genshin, Honkai Impact, which is basically this, but with a more immediately out of the gate, oh my god, level story that starts that way, then kind of decelerates, and then really accelerates again. I haven't beat it because I suck. It's also mobile and my phone started overheating. It's also really addictive and they have so many good characters and so much plot that I'm really hoping that we eventually get in this game because so much plot. The uh, physics of anatomy were very interesting. And considering my wife is in the other room, I'm just going to leave it at that. Yeah. Huh, don't let me show that. Okay, there it goes. <laughs> God. Let's see. So, Jordan, you made 139 hours without food and drink. Holy shit, George. One, I didn't know that was possible. Two, I hope you're all right. Huh? Unless you're talking in a game, in which case, yeah. Hmm. Oh, hello, child. I'm going to choose someone who's your height. Damn it. I was going to be taller than you, but no, you just had to screw it up. Why does everyone have to be taller than the main character? Aha, uh -huh, you made it. Still want to punch you. Still want to punch you. As promised, I found someone who can help you. Someone who can solve the mystery of why the Liyue Chising would hide the Jiu Archon's vessel. Still expecting that you killed him somehow. So, where is he? In Liyue Pavilion? Mm hmm. <sighs> oh, and Pabra, as you know, yes, the plot in that game is quite thick. Which gives me hope for this game. He certainly is. Come, I'll introduce you. Seriously, though, and if, again, I know we're getting Child as a character we can use, but if Honkai is any indication, getting your enemies as characters you can use is not out of the question. I took the liberty of setting up a business dinner, as per the Liu custom. Really? Business dinner? We're going to eat you out of everything you have. Ooh, interesting change in the music. I'm also not jealous of his clothing. Welcome back, sir. You honor us with your patronage. Mr. Zhongli is awaiting your arrival in the room you booked. <laughs> A certain person's smooth voice? Uh, Tham? I'm not sure who you mean. He's the only characters I've met are child so far. Unless there's someone else I'm missing. Oh yeah, wizard. I'll probably try and get him. I'm not sure how hard I'll go, just because... I'm not sure if I like his fighting style or not yet. I'll have to see, like, his actual uh, challenge quest, which I still need to do for Cree, uh, Klee. I mean, it's 20 free gems. Why wouldn't I do it? Because I'm an idiot, that's why. Oh, jeez. Probably do that next. 
Ooh, tea. I need those cups. Hi. People keep talking about this guy as the other one we can get. Get his name. Oh, he also has the glowy clothing. Allow me to introduce Mr. Zhong Li, consultant Zhongli? to an organization known as Wang Sheng, and a trusted associate of the Fatui. And already I don't trust him. Indeed, Wang Sheng's line of work can be sensitive at times. Let's just say they understand when discretion is needed. So he's an assassin? And we, the Fatui, have always been glad to do business with friends who walk in the shadows. Yeah, yeah, he's definitely an assassin or a spy. An assassin or a spy. I do not know which. Walk in the shadows? With a knife to your back. And a word saying, you're dead. It is an honor to oh, meet damn. you. I have heard tell of you from Mondstadt. The voice sounds familiar. I almost recognize the voice actor. Discretion? Shadows? <sighs> is Wong Shen some kind of business involving dealing with people? I'm not sure that I like coming to the same conclusion as Paimon. I'm actually a little disturbed by how much I agree with her. Like, seriously, not not even just now, in previous videos, it's like, ha, I'm agreeing with Paimon, or I say something at the same time her character does, and it's like, oh, oh, I'm not all right with this. To which I would say, I'm really not all right with this. It's like Indeed. getting to the unironic part now. It is as you have guessed. And he's confirming it. He's an assassin. <laughs> the Wong Sheng Funeral Parlor what? organizes burials. We ensure that those who pass on do so in peace. On the one hand, he could just be a funeral director. On the other hand... Uh... That is way more ominous that they need someone who's good at handling the death of people in discretion to deal with the Fatui. Because they love it when people die in peace without others knowing. Dear God, oh, did he just blink? Oh, I thought his animation was frozen, but no, I think he just blinked. Yeah, there it goes, yeah. Huh? <laughs> hey, Spence Dog, what's up, man? <laughs> did you think he was some sort of hired killer? To be fair, he still kind of sounds like one. The Fatui calls many such people friends, but the Wang Sheng Funeral Parlor does not dabble in such business. Well, ostensibly. See, that last part, that last part you added in there, that, that's where we're like, oh, he's an assassin. Well, they are still, uh, I shouldn't say too much. In any case, I brought you to meet Mr. Zhang Yay, Li because... For hire. Why? Because I can bring you to see Rex Lapis's vessel. Oh. What? Oh yeah, they got a vessel and they're being controlled. <laughs> Don't be so surprised. Sure, the Geo Archon's body has been squirreled away by order of the Tian Chuan Ning Guang. But first, let's hear what Mr. Zhang Li has to say, shall we? Oh? Rex Lapis may be the prime of Adepti, but he is ultimately an Adeptus. Many Adepti have left us over the millennia. This is the inexorable trend. So he's not the Archon. That's good to confirm. So he's the Adepti in the same way that uh, Storm Terror was kind of like the familiar-ish variation. I think I got that right. The times have changed. You must have felt it too when you were at Jueun Karst. No, they were kind of murdery, yeah. See, I don't want to say this first one because it doesn't sound like they're staying away. It sounds like they're very ready to get in there and just start going, Hey, burn it all! Yeah. Archons go by many names. The God of Contracts, the God of Commerce, the God of War, Morax, Rex Lapis. Oh? Is the idea that he also has the title of Adeptus so strange? Yes, because it means I didn't understand it, but also me not understanding something so weird. As you have seen, the time of the Adepti is ending, and the time of mankind is slowly dawning. To be fair, they kind of were hands off already. In years past, Liu's tradition was that a huge memorial service be held to mark the passing of every Adeptus. So they just regularly died. But this too. time, huh. 
The Qixing have made no attempt whatsoever to respect this tradition. Well, you it know, he, he was kind of dead when they weren't expecting. Wait, did he say it's selfish, but then the text is it's sacrilege? Oh. Yeah, the killer hasn't even been caught yet. I wonder which of those two I am looking at who is the killer. Seriously, it's one of them. There's no way Be it's not. aside or not, the concern of the Wangsheng funeral parlor is this. When the ritual to receive this god is so kingly, it is all the more egregious for his final send-off to go unattended to. I wonder if they've removed the body from the game yet. Because before, when I walked up there... Oh, sorry, my nose is me. Yeah. Was I looking excuse to make those weird noises? The game just change. How long have we been having tea? Traveler. Child has told me a lot about you. Since you have had dealings with the Animo Archon, could I ask you to help me prepare the Geo Archon's last rites? So he was the Archon specifically. And then there's a vessel for him as well. So that's... I wonder how this works out. Because it almost seems like they're moving from body to body. So when one dies, another one's there. It's like soul movement? I, I don't know. I would love to know more of the metaphysics of this. Think about it. Except... Child says too much. <laughs> I want to say that just to throw him under the bus. Oh? In our line of work, this means that you want to silence me. How interesting. Draw your sword. We shall... He took it correctly. <laughs> oh. Just kidding. Let's continue, shall we? Yeah. The Tianquan Ningguang has forbidden anyone from accessing Rex Lapis's vessel, which of course you would need to access if you were to achieve your goal of meeting all of the seven. Is the vessel the current one? Hmm. Well, in a second, need coffee. Oh, that's nice. So apparently, if the body's still there, it's a glitch. Honestly, it's a really funny glitch. Personal opinion. Precisely. Only by participating in the rite of parting will you be able to see the form of Rex Lapis again. Ah, so we definitely have to do that. If we are agreed, come with me. We will speak of the details as we walk. Great voice, though. Also, Darth Griff in the chat said... In Assassin's Creed Funeral Home, you hire us to kill them, and then they send them on the way. It is very much one-stop shopping at that point. <laughs> oh, God. Ah, Esme, you gotta head All out. Right. All right, my bridge-building work here is done. Turned out well, didn't it? You're way too happy about someone who is definitely an assassin. You can go if you want to. Don't worry about me. I might just have a few more drinks, and get acquainted with these things they call chopsticks in the meantime. Uh, no, no, I'm going to stick around and watch you fail. Do it. Fail for my pleasure, sir. I really don't know why I just viscerally dislike him. Probably because I'm fully expecting to find out he's some kind of monster that we're going to have to fight. And he'll probably win because plot. Yeah. The perfume lady? See, here's the thing. Everyone keeps talking about the perfume lady. I don't know who they're talking about. It's a quest? The only person I got who was like a little over the top was like that one bakery lady who's like, oh god, is she talking about a, a freaking brothel? Like, no, no, it's just buns. She just talks about freaking like buns, literal bread buns, like pork buns and just bread loaves. And she talks about it in the most lewd way possible. Oh god. Oh, Hans. Uh, right now I'm at AR 34. I've just been randomly running around doing stuff, not really doing the quests. So I've started doing them like in the last day or two. I got a lot of them done, but I still find more here and there. And plus, whenever you explore, you get random world quests that just pop up. Not the world quest, world quest, but quests you get from exploring the world. They're not even marked. They're just things you happen to get every now and again. And if you don't get them right away, they'll despawn. So those usually add a nice bit. It's just one of the reasons I think just walking around the place to explore is really helpful. See her during this screening? Oh, so whoever the perfume lady is is coming up. Really curious to see how Zhang Li and Child play, though. I haven't seen the demos of them. Ah, I think I'm taller than you. 
Uh, suspend dog, you're in quarantine? Ooh, hope you're alright, man. Stay safe, man. On the other hand, great time to not go outside. It's getting way too cold anyways. After That's having true. experienced the land of the absentee Archon, yeah. Traveler, how does it feel to know that our Archon and Adepti are here all around you in Liyue? Eh, honestly, it seems the same. They're kind of absent to begin with. Honestly, <laughs> there's really no difference. No, seriously, there, there's literally no difference. The only thing is they pay lip service here and use it as like a point of pride, but they're really no different. Like, they, it's really not. They're not here doing anything. They're just off doing their own thing on mountaintops in a completely different section. They're completely disconnected. This does not make sense as a question. I'm a little annoyed. I do kind of prefer Mondstadt, though. <laughs> I see. So you're that sort of person. Also, it's they kind of laughed. Not a bad thing. <laughs> yeah. Good old Barbatos getting laughed at his face. But I suppose you have yet to experience the substance of Leo's 3,700 years of divinity. Yeah, no, I'll pass. Organizing the rite of parting should prove to be an enlightening part of your travels. Seriously, you're some kind of... You definitely have a vision. You got the glowy clothing. Only people with visions have glowy clothing. Ah. <sighs> oh, yeah, Hans, huh? the roll breakdown. Yeah, the 76th through the 77th roll have hot, like a 20% chance of being a 5-star. And I think it goes a little higher than that sometimes. And if you don't get it there, then it drops back down to normal levels, and you get it on the pity of 90 where it's guaranteed. I'm slowly every day now just throwing another one or two rolls into it just from the free... Uh, in-game currency, I get. I forget. I keep calling it same course because of FGO, but yeah, I've been doing that. <laughs> Liyue is the he most the prosperous of the seven nations, defended is by deities and ruled by the Qixing. As such, the diplomatic maneuverings of the Fatui have gained no purchase here. I mean, they do have a bank, and you're kind of on his call. He's listening to you. I, I think they got a little purchase there. You're here. Ming Wang of the Qixing has always been on her guard against the Fatui. Are you liking her more? That is in all likelihood why Child wants to make use of the Wang Sheng Funeral Parlor's connections. Yeah, makes sense. We're probably being set up to get rid of her. Huh. What would Child get out of us doing the rite of parting anyway? Clear up his mess? I neither know nor do I wish to know. As far as I am concerned, the Fatui are merely financial sponsors. I only wish for Liyue's traditions to endure. Your traditions are stupid. Mostly because you're definitely an assassin. Seriously. These are the really? advanced funds the child has provided. If you use them up, you can go to him to apply for any subsequent funding. Also, one of the things I'm wondering about is how come no one comments on Paimon literally flying? Just right there. It's right there, flying, floating around. Freaking Halo. No one says anything. It's like, oh, you're small. Why is that what they comment on? Wow. <sighs> well then, also, it's stupid let calling. us be off. The first step in our preparations shall be to obtain some prize Noctilucus Jade oh, worthy of the deity. That's how you said Noctilucus? Oh, God. I was going to call it Noctilith. Oh, yeah, that's more Minecraft. I got a shit ton of that stuff already. Funds provided by Childe. Sorry, child. I honestly just can't stand that name. Also, I know there's a quest here, but I can't trigger it. It's bugging me. Is this the one? No. Or is it? Uh, join the adventurers no. guild. What if I trigger this one? No. No, it's not. <laughs> oh, God, Andrew. If I could do this with Pretty Guardian, I would. But my wife, because it's a gacha game, she's completely nope at it. She might enjoy it, but I think right now she would want to farm more. She's the kind of person who farmed for all the time. And the fact that it's time-gated would probably piss her off. So I really haven't pushed her on that one. Also, I should probably go here. Go and buy Noctilus. Octilacusacus, however you say it, Jade. <gasps> yeah, Claremont, I've heard a lot of people thinking he's the real Geo Archon. 
It's weird how they have that work out. Oh yeah, this guy, who I've never really figured out the point of. Oh, one sec, uh, just beep. Ah, there we go. I have a bad habit of sitting on my feet when I do this. I go numb every now and again. Welcome wow, to I feel Jade thin mystery, by my good friends. Would you like to try your luck betting on Jade? This could be your lucky day. No. It's cheap and it's fun, and who knows? You just might strike it rich. You're an idiot. Betting? No, no, we're... Nocta Lucas Jade. Nocta of radiant Lucas, grade it. at the very least. Radiant grade, Nocta Lucas Jade? I see. You're not a tourist. My apologies. I have some here for your perusal. You just keep it randomly out there when you're on a street stall? Sure. That sounds like a good business practice. What do you practice. think? The Jade Mystery is an old name in the Jade business. Just look at that wonderful quality. Rex Lapis doesn't often bless us with such finery. Go on, pick whichever one you like. Well, considering he kind of did, uh, I would agree, yes, he probably isn't going to be blessing it. These three pieces really do look pretty. Not like the ones you usually dig up. They've been polished. But how do we pick? Should we just grab one and go? I mean, the top one's accurate, so... <laughs> Very good. It seems you have learned some tricks of the trade. Yeah, because the guy who runs a scam is so trustworthy. I mean, oh god. EA, man. Oh god, Pybro, you're right, he is EA. <laughs> What do you oh, think, Mr. Zhongli? How should we pick from these pieces of Nocta Lucas Jade? Oh? Take all three. You want me to decide? That is fine as well. Yeah, plus you got the entire glowing eye thing. Seriously, has anyone else noticed that? If it were me, the answer would be simple. Take all them all? Punch the guy in the face? Rob him? I'm okay with that. Yeah, let's do it. Oh? And He's trying to cheat us? We can beat be... his face up. I'll take them all, boss. What? That sounds like a dumb oh, idea. You act with such panache, good sir. I always knew you were not a this man of like ordinary caliber. Oh, wait, wait, boss. That one didn't count. We need to discuss it again. He's used to having money, isn't he? Hey, if we only need one for the ritual, are we wasting three times the more if we buy them all? On the other hand, we're wasting child's mora. Okay, I'm okay with this. Oh, mora. Hmm. He forgot completely. It is as you say. I suppose I overlooked this particular aspect of the transaction. And suddenly... Venti seems more intelligent, down to earth, and thoughtful. Mm. My God! So, Spent Dog, you said you give me a YouTube or Google tracking ID so I can Mac a YouTube channel. Do not know how to do that. Sorry, I don't actually know what a tracking or attacking ID is. Sorry about that. Huh? How do you not think about more? Stupidity. If one must always consider Mora before acting, then in all things one is bound by Mora. You do realize the counterpoint to that is it's because you need it, you. It almost seems. He's used to scamming people, isn't he? Uh, what? He's an idiot. He's an all idiot. Mora is currency, but not all currency is Mora. Yes, we get it. People have many forms of trade. What? You're also sounding really off on it. Is this how the rich live? Or the people who are really poor but like to sound like they're not. Well, he knows a lot He's about big really money, rich or really but poor. not There's a no lot about, about big savings. One. No need anyway. to waver. Even when I am constrained by Mora, I have ways of working around my limitations. It's called stealing. Evaluating the quality of Nocta Lucas Jade is indeed very tricky. As crude ore, there is little difference in texture, lustrousness, and internal pattern between good and bad jade. 
He's using us to bilk child, isn't he? Only after the item made using Noctilucus Jade has taken shape will you be able to see whether it is up to par or not. So in other words, you literally just threw money away. Oh my god. Also, Defective AI! What's up, man? Also, for everyone wondering, Defective AI isn't just one of the members of the channel. He's currently running the D&D &D campaign, which I'll be streaming on Thursdays going forward. And, um, I will be deferential because he may or may not have some kind of surprise set up from Wild Magic and I might be terrified and I'm absolutely terrified to say anything right now because, oh my god, I don't know what any of this happening and just... He's, uh, <laughs> yeah, he might be a little evil. If you return to those crafty merchants to quibble, they will counter by saying that your crafting bench is to blame or that your heat control was poor. Counterpoint? You might just be bad at making things. Whoa! To think it's that easy to get cheated! Sometimes, though, you actually are just bad at making things. Just, just throw it out there! But there is a way to truly evaluate this jade. And a true insight. Why do I get the impression that he's BSing us? A fool sees the pointer and misses the moon. Pointer? What does that mean? Nothing, probably. If you point at the moon with your finger, a wise man knows that you are pointing at the moon, while a fool will only see the finger. Unless you're not pointing to the moon and people make the wrong assumption, you can make a story the of anything. The facade. These are all the finger. Noctilucus Jade is a mystical stone used to light up the darkness, and so its brightness is the important problems? thing. It, Noctilucus Jade of excellent quality would have superior pyro affinity. In other words, the bluer and brighter the luster of the ore under high temperature, oh. the higher its quality. Oh, that's actually really cool to know. I have imparted the priceless secrets of the Jade trade to you. Now, all that's left is to put it into practice. <laughs> Yeah, Pybros, I do get the entire King from One Punch Man vibe. He does seem to know what he's talking about. Also, the entire thing about the Jade is, oh, so it's useless unless you can actually build something with it. And people keep saying you're just not good at it, so I have the same impression you're, you're actually just bad at it. Because you're making it sound like everyone says that. Priceless, huh? Paimon's just said that we might never be able to use it again. Heh. Huh? <laughs> We're back to buy some rocks, boss. But can you let us burn them first? What? Uh, burn them? You can't do that, my friends. If you were to do so, what would I have to sell? Samples is actually not a bad idea. That would... Well, fine. As you wish, then. Oh, he's actually okay with it? Uh, how about this? I can take a small sample of all three. I'll take a bit of a loss. Uh, we'll count it as a friendly gesture. <laughs> yeah, honestly, that's not a bad idea. It's a discount. Don't worry. I know the rules. As long as we can prove that it is good jade, you will not take a loss. God. All right. Take these as samples. I've carved them off with a knife and tagged them to boot. Yeah, cool. Aren't these too thin? Even paper's thicker. No, even a bug's wings are thicker. No, that makes sense. We don't These need to burn are all this see through. <laughs> oh, you flattered me, but I have to be gentle with impressive. these rocks. They are my pride and joy. So even though he's a swindler, he's a skilled swindler. I'm actually respecting him more. If I'd taken off even a bit more, it <laughs> it would have killed me. Uh huh. But wouldn't would have killed something your wallet. this thin go poof if we held it to the fire? Yes. It can't be helped. Trying to deprive a merchant of his profits would be like forcing a ravenous wolf to vomit up the food in its stomach. Not impossible. Nonetheless, under the right conditions, these thin slices will serve. I think it's what? Cacum powder? No, talcum powder? No. Ah, uh, cacao? It's something like that that does that. What sort of conditions? While we add the high temperatures using pyro, we can use hydro to reinforce it from within. This way, the samples will not disintegrate immediately. It's the immediately part there. Also, is that kind of an explosive thing? Oh, God. 
Oh! <laughs> oh, sir, to think you were this learned. Thank you for your understanding. It sounds like he's bullshitting us even harder now. Strictly speaking, asking for samples when we have not yet agreed to purchase the goods is unfair. Trade in Liyue must be based upon fairness. This guy really likes his fairness in trade, huh? Well, guess we just need to find a place to try this out. Oh yeah, Zhang Lu's You place. mean at Wanmin Restaurant? Uh, sorry, not taking any game requests right now. As long as we do it when she's not in. Why? She that probably tried to eat would it. not do. It is a place where people come and go. They would be endangered if the elemental reaction were to get out of control. We cannot take such a risk. Seems a little shady. Oh, Paimon remembers. We once saw this big pot oh, down yeah, at the dead at Upa Gorge oh, wow, in the that camp came of up. the hilly trolls from the Meaty Tribe. It's real sturdy and should be able to take the elemental reactions. That was a side quest. What would... Okay, this is actually just my own question for everyone in the chat. Does the game's dialogue change depending on the side quest you've done prior? Because I'm actually a little questionable here. <laughs> so defectively, you want me to crouch the sneak and pickpock the merchant? Oh, if we could, I would have stolen everything he had already. I've been doing it every time I see a chest in this town. I'm like, ah, mine now. Now, let's pack those samples up and make a move. Would we have had this dialogue if we hadn't done that quest? Huh. Not the jade samples. You must go to the Meaty Tribe. <laughs> oh, God. Wait. Wait, wait, so Han said, and I'm not able to verify this myself, but Zhao is voiced by Dante Baco. Oh, the guy who did Zuko. Wow. That's actually kind of impressive. Also, there's a ship over here. I haven't been able to reach it yet. I'm a little annoyed. I'm going to have to fix that if it's the last thing I do. I'd rather it not be the last thing, though. Hmm. Let's see. <sighs> Gotta love coffee. And yeah, so Pui? P-U-I-U? I have no idea how to say that. So I'm just going to mispronounce your name. My apologies. But Pui? Pui, p pu eu pui. Right, why do I keep saying an e in there? Ugh. But person whose name I cannot pronounce. Oh God, I cannot see what say. But person whose name I cannot pronounce. I know the pot wasn't part of the quest, but at the same time, it has been a long time okay. since I last set foot in the nation of wind. Where the hell are you? A friend of mine from Mondstadt would always bring a few bottles of locally brewed dandelion wine. Whenever like he came green? to visit me in Liwa. It must be said that the feigned liquor of the land of Pastorals is far better than Sumeru's frigid snake wine. Snake wine? That sounds murdery! Oh, yeah. That would do it. Yeah, that would do it. Also, he's not even hiding he's the Geo Archon, is he? I'm guessing Rex Lapis is just taking the bait or something? Hmm. How do I want to do this? With violence. <laughs> That's the pot! <sighs> it looks like the hilly trolls are still using it. Fix that! I'm gonna cut the line! <laughs> yeah. Burn! Yeah. Oh, I missed! Oh well, might as well hit you while you're stuck. Come on, Diluc, do your thing! I guess he's dead. Yeah. There's still soup in here! These hilly trolls Wait, should have big appetites! Havercorn? Damn, they got a lot of really good talent in this. Hans, yeah, we know exactly what he's talking about. He definitely has a relationship with Diluc. It's kind of awkward. I never expected that, but yeah, that's definitely who he means. <laughs> God. It's our lab now. 
<laughs> let it go to this waste. soup looks like it could be used as our hydro elemental protection. What? Let's fire it up and begin our experiment. That seems like a bad idea. Bad, Paimon. Bad. Bad. Where's a water bottle when you need go. one? Paimon will help remember which one of the three is which. She's not going to remember. Use Pyro to keep making the pot hotter oh until God, we get the game. results we need. Oh, shit. This is a minigame. I am so fucked. <laughs> Mr. Zhongli said that the shinier oh and bluer the ore gets, the better it is. So, pay oh close God. attention. I'm so screwed. I do not do minigames well. And I can't quick save, so... <laughs> do I need to... Okay, I need to go full fire team, don't I? Alrighty then. If we're going full fire team, I'm going full fire team. Got Shai Ling, got Amber. I don't have enough fire users. Son of a. What's our objective? But I think I can. Oh, he's Geo right now. Didn't keep you waiting, did I? I, I can make this work. Hmm. Fireworks! Whoa! That light came from the first Noctilucus Jade! <gasps> Hilly trolls are surrounding us again! Were they attracted by the light? Are they all on? Oh, oh, Let's take care of them. Oh, you've yeah, gotta be can... kidding me, really? Alright, Benji, do your thing. I wonder gliding be fast. As you wish, Ming Foy Light. Yeah, I got lost there for a second. I summon thee! Okay, Benji, do your thing. No, I don't want to attack it. I want to. Okay. I'm just gonna let Venti do the work for me. <sighs> Fine. So busy. Here we go. Seriously, oh, Venti yeah, does great there. Are they still oh, here? Okay. What? Well, doing something dumb. Boom. Take that. Take that to the face. As you wish, main Fräulein. Why did it miss? How did it miss? I don't even know why it missed. How do you miss that? Burn. <laughs> yes. Fire. Oh, you thought you were going to live. No, it was me. Fire, yo. Hmm. It was so much shinier than the rest. Let's go with that one. Let's pick them all Let's up. Let's head back to the Jade Mystery to buy some Jade, shall we? How do I get in there to pick it up? Just let me get in the pot. I, I cannot get in there. Why? It's not letting me. You son of a bitch. I blame you, Paimon. Is it your fault? No. Is it? Yes. Also, I realized I didn't switch to you. <laughs> uh, is there a flower on it? Is there a flower before? I honestly don't remember. Huh. Be kind of cool if the weapon changes based on season or location. Now, let's just drop down here. Oh, that's actually going to be really close. I love teleportation points. Seriously, they're awesome. Although I think the best one is the one at the top of the high peak. It's just neat. Uh, Chiriac. I can say that name. Yeah, the game's broken. Can't pick up the Noctilus Jade. Better reinstall it. Yep. Oh, and delete all data to make sure it's non-corrupted. I'm sure that won't go bad at all. <laughs> oh, God. And Darth Griff said it's literally Food Wars hack and slash while cooking. Considering all the food dishes in here, and some of them are actually really good. Yeah, I can see it. Oh, I wonder if there's like a steampunk. We got the mid uh, medieval town in Mondstadt. We got the... I'm going with maybe Chinese-inspired. With Liwe. Looks really cool. God, is there like a techno or steampunk turn? I, I would love to see that. Oh, 
Oh yeah, and Chirag, this is on PS4. Mm, excuse me. You're back, my friends. I've kept the goods for you. Which of them would you like? Did you change them out? I'm on said third. Mm. Oh, crow, yeah, no problem. Some meals were good. Ah, uh, crap, she said third, right? It's all the same, ah, uh, whatever. Exactly! That's the one Paimon remembers, too! It's not, is it? I just fucked up, didn't I? No problem. If you have your eye on this one, you can have it. <sighs> ah, fuck that. Then yeah. we'll take a box of the third type of jade. Done. All the Does same, uh, pardon me for asking, but I'm curious. Whatever do you need this much top quality Noctilucus Jade for? Yeah, why? Oh, Chirag, you're playing a, on a laptop with between 40 and 60 frames per second? Eh, not bad. I mean, I got it on my desktop and it does hit the higher end, but then nothing else on my computer can run. Uh, seriously though, it does look cool when you have the power to do it. On PS4 though, it doesn't run nearly that fast. That said, it's still really awesome. Hmm. I just prefer the controller setup. I suppose it would not hurt to tell you. We need them to make implements for the rite of parting. Why are you telling the random stranger who scams people? Parting? Oh, dear. Seriously? You're an I'd idiot. heard the rumors, but had given much thought to them. This... This means that Rex Lapis really is... Oh, it's hard to believe. Even though the Jade Mystery has been in decline, we have always been under his protection. Jade Mystery? It is said that when our Lord lost oh, yeah. his way while going incognito in the city 200 years ago, it was a spoon from the Jade Mystery that he had used to sample the local delights. Really? Really? Your entire thing is built around him using a spoon made of jade? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, this is... I, I don't even... Ooh, you did climb in a castle in Germany when you were 12? George, I am so jealous. That sounds amazing. Alas. Alas, <laughs> all things must pass. <sighs> well, if this is to be used to say farewell to Rex Lapis, then I shall sell this to you at half the price. Half price? Yeah, sure. I mean, we're not gouging child nearly as much, but... Are yeah. you sure? You didn't want to even give us an inch before. Do Ascension XP Bank? Ding, I'm not entirely sure what you mean. What do you mean XP Bank? If not for our Lord's protection, this city wouldn't exist as it does now. No proprietor could earn money off such a thing. What? I'm sure Rex Lapis will so, feel your sentiment, boss. Basically, the reason you couldn't make money off it is because it's too expensive for normal people. Not enough people want it the higher end because it's kind of useless. So you're in a bad industry that's only propped up by a rich guy who likes it. Yeah, okay, sure. It makes sense. There's dumber things out there. In the safe hands of the Liu Achising and good, honest merchants such as yourself. Honest. <laughs> I, for one, believe that Liu Er will continue to prosper. Your definition of honesty is a little off, sir. All right. Thank you, my friends. What's with me getting all sentimental like yeah. this? I'll practically be giving away all my fortune at this rate. Eh, yeah, you're giving away to a god who's burying another version of your god. So we're now that we've that. made our choice, let's take this Noctilucus Jade back. Hey, wait a minute. He said it was half price. Not that we could leave without paying. Uh, oh, right. I'm sorry. I must have forgotten to do that, too. Sure Let me you see. did. As I thought, I didn't bring any. Thankfully, Child gave us money for this. Any what? Mora, my apologies. Another oversight on my part. Oversight. Yeah, that's exactly what it was. God, we're being scammed so hard by both of them. Oh, that won't do. This isn't some small sum. Oh, wait. D How much did he give us? That's a relief. Have Not a even close. 
It's fine. Just enough for half price. <laughs> Though, to be honest, it'd be all right even if the sum wasn't quite enough. Oh? There's two ways to take that. One, he would accept less because of, you know, Rex Lapis. Two, he's scamming us so hard because he's inflating the price so that half off is bullshit. It's like when you mark something up by three-fourths and then you give it a half off sale the next day. It's actually something that's been... It's highly discredited, but it's something that places actually do. Ugh, there's actually a few laws in some states against that, but it's a well, thing. Well, it's settled then. Let's take this jade to Yujing Terrace. Yujing Terrace? That's where we plan to hold the right. Have I been there? Probably. I think I've been most places. Hmm. Oh, so Ding in the comments said, when you hit the XP limit, you need to do the ascension. Don't, don't keep earning XP, so when you do get to the next ascension, you get a couple of levels of XP as well. Oh. Huh. So, Ding, are you saying I should earn a bunch of XP and stock it up before doing the ascension? Oh, I didn't even think of that. Hmm. Look at you bossing everyone around. You didn't cough up a single Mora. Uh-huh. God. He was put in contact with us so we can pay him. Because he also just got some of this as well from us. Uh. Hmm. It seems that we must. I will keep that in mind. I see why Thanks, he works with the Fatui, because he seems to be very not having money. <laughs> oh, God. Uh. <laughs> Seriously, he just scammed us. Because he was going to have us pay for it if we didn't have enough. Dear God. The brass balls on that guy. All right. Oh, yeah, it's the same place where the guy died. I wonder where this perfume lady everyone talks about is. Seriously, everyone keeps talking about her. It's like, oh yeah, perfume lady, perfume lady, perfume lady. Where the hell is the perfume lady? I don't even know who it is yet. It's one of those things I kind of want to look it up to find out, but at the same time, I would like to actually just get it to normally. And, oh wait, there's no sport. Yes. Be patient. <laughs> no. <laughs> Patience. That's funny. <laughs> How do I get? Oh, do I go this way? New does not look like it. Whee! You know, self, don't steal everything. I might be looking for a chest. Do I see a chest? Hmm. Hello, random stranger who I'm going to talk to for no reason. Or I'll break the game. You're in public. Why would you not expect strangers? <laughs> Ooh, flowers. I must resist urge to pick flowers. God, my collecting nature is bugging me right now. It's like I see something I can grab. I want to grab it. <laughs> so I need to follow the story to get to the perfume lady? All right. Still kind of curious what everyone means, because people are really talking about her. Like, I have no idea who she is, and everyone has mentioned her from almost immediately into the game. And no one's telling me why, either. So, yeah, I am stopping to pick these because they're really hard and I saw the prices to buy them flat out. <laughs> no. Probably essential materials for all I know. I've never let them actually die. <laughs> We're gonna do it at dawn. Would it gliding be faster? Yeah, Venti, it would be. <laughs> Too bad you're stuck on the ground like a mere mortal. <laughs> Stupid god. Stupid, probably dying god. We're going to Would it gliding be faster? Claremont, she's Lisa's mentor? Oh my. So what do we do with this? Hmm. Oh yeah, more jade. Noise. We can leave the jade here. I have already called for a jewelsmith to shape them into the implements that we will need. You specifically carve them for the individual passing? Ah, yes. I have yet to go and see child. So, as for the jewelsmith's remuneration... Yeah, no, Guess I'm not taking this debt on me. Else. Also, is this where we're doing the rite of party? bastard. Oh my god, really? Yes. 
I have already rented this location and have begun making preparations for the rite. Mm-hmm. Right, dissension took your so we're just yeah, we're just using the, the crime scene. The Liu have agreed to this arrangement. Oh? When did they do that? When something this big happened here, should suspects like us really be at the crime scene? We might get caught by the Millilith. To be fair, we fought them already and we kicked their ass. <laughs> the creepy in-game glitch thing? Yeah, Although it's fun. with that said, since we got back from Dway and Karst, None of those pesky Millilith soldiers have to be come fair, chasing after us. To be fair, when we walked around us. prior to that, they weren't chasing us either, so... Also, the, uh, Rex Lapis vessel... It's kind of not there anymore, yeah. Traditionally, we call it the Exuvia. Yeah. Oh, it's traditionally called that. Ah, oh, right! That's what it was called. You seem to know everything, Mr. Zhongli. We? Um, so, was this Exuvia hidden away by the chasing? I mean, we haven't even figured out child. who the murderer is. Definitely child. Or him. Probably child. One must think that they already have someone in mind. Or perhaps they already know. Surely they must have found all the evidence that there is to find here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I wonder who did it. If only there was someone suspicious. Like maybe connected to a group of an expansionist god who would randomly stab a god in a different country like Mondstadt. I mean, that kind of group would be really suspicious, right? These <laughs> things are for the authorities in Yujing Terrace to consider. God, you're just Trying to help would probably only add to their troubles. Before uh -huh. the rite is conducted, the Exuvia will be kept temporarily in the Golden House. Golden House? There's a house of gold in the The only mint in Liu, which is to say the only mint in Tevat. All the mora that flows throughout the world is what? minted there. What? Oh, okay, so that's a thing. Wow. Hi, bros. That's a thing. Um, it might be pronounced kilfe or kilde, but every single person in the game, at least in the English translation, is pronouncing a child. I was kind of hoping it pronounced childe, but I not lucky enough on that one. Oh, no. Thinking about yes, she was. Bad. Paimon thinks it suits Morax. Now that's interesting. We've heard the name Morax before, but she's using the older name. Huh. I wonder... It's like she knew him when he was older or something, or younger. I mean, can you imagine how weird that would be if Paimon was maybe older than we thought? I mean, that'd be silly. But why do you know this, Mr. Zhongli? Since the rite of parting has the approval of the Qixing... It is a semi-official event. As such, there is already some limited information available. Uh... Yeah... Perhaps each has their motives. But this is the capital of commerce. A little exploitation once in a while is not unacceptable. A little? So if he is the real Geo Archon, does anyone else get the impression the entire contracts thing was to make sure he didn't scam anyone? Like, literally, I'm pretty sure the entire God of Contracts thing is specifically to keep him in line, because he seems like a massive scam artist. In Liu, where the <laughs> God of Contracts reigns, only contracts may not be betrayed. Uh-huh. I, for one, have no issue with little maneuvers outside their remit. Uh-huh. Well, then... We should go and prepare the perfumes used in the rite. How much is this going to cost us? Perfumes? Where will we get those? Do we buy them? No. Perfumes used to honor the gods must be freshly decocted. The quality of the silk flowers we require is also special. They got a ton of them. Silk flower petals contain a fibrous material of good quality, often used in brocade making. Yep. Its scent, however, is most elegant Silk scent? and is especially oh. suited for solemn events like giving offerings to gods and adepti. Uh -huh. It's time for Zhang Li's lectures on high society again. <laughs> God damn it, Paimon. <laughs> we shall not speak of the details right now. Follow me. We shall go to the merchants to purchase our ingredients. Oh. Ooh, 
Ooh, hey, pretty close to 34. Nice. Well, if only there was a way to get there really fast. I can climb to this. There's a cat up there! I want to see the catty. I want to see the kitty. I want to see the kitty. Should I be doing something else? Yes. Will I see the cat instead? Yeah, also doing that. Ooh, that actually worked. Come on. Benji, do your thing. Oh, did I just turn the... When I did that, it actually turned blue. Yeah, that's actually kind of cool. Kitty! My greatest regret in this game, you can make eye contact with the cat, but you can't pet the fucking kitty! Like, there, there's no kitty button! There, there's no kitty button. I am a little upset about that. Mihoyo, fix that. Like, seriously, though, if you actually put a bit, like, a, just a little button, say, pet the kitty. Please... There's so many dogs yourself. and cats, and it's like, I want to pet them! And then I can't! And it bugs me! I'm easily bugged! Mm. Also, I love how they do hide chests up here. Not many, but there have been a few. So, where are we going? Oh, uh, here? Alright. So, do I talk to you? You. Person. Oh, I need to talk to the other guy. Who are you? Oh, yeah! He did the thing with the place! Am I in the wrong place? Am I in the wrong place? Eh. Oh, God. So... Really, it's gonna be one of those issues. All right, all right, all right. Actually, I'm just gonna do this for luck right now. Let's see, what am I at right now? I kinda wanna know how far up I've driven it. I've just been putting one or two in every day just because of playing and opening chests. So I'm kinda curious. George, if there was one feature, it would be pet the kitty. Yeah, and the puppy. Because kitty, puppy, they're awesome. So that's one. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay, yeah, so start a six. Five times six is 30. We're 30 draws in right now. That means there's another 60 until the absolute minimum. Hmm. Not bad. <laughs> so happy wants me to join the dark side. Oh, God. I'm gonna do a wish. Make it 31. From what I heard though, every first draw is always really bad. If you do a lot more after that, their odds get better. And they do vary over time. Oh my god! Another bow! I am the shock. <laughs> Should I save that? Yeah. But nah. Uh David, I'll probably go for Chill Day just because I don't have many bow archers I want to use. Venti is strictly for skills. Same with a lot of the people, actually. Wait, what am I doing? Oh, yeah, I forgot. There was actually something below here. Goodbye, cruel world! I forgot this scummy guy. Yeah. Hey, boss. Do you sell silk flowers here? Silk flowers? We certainly we do. Them. Oh, there's a bonsai. Which kind would you like? Cool. Which kind? The... Ugh, you ignorant shoppers. Can I punch Always him? coming in here with your stupid questions. Can I punch him? Golden housemaiden, valley weaver, and fate's yearning. One of each to start oh with, my. if you don't mind. My goodness, this gentleman is quite the connoisseur. He has expensive taste, yes. You two must be his servants. What? Please refrain from any further attempts to contribute. This is what I get for calling Paimon emergency food. <laughs> now then, please peruse. I just had to choose leisure. that option. Oh my Do god, let that's me adorable. Know if you have any further thoughts. Not if I can help it. Oh, oh, you meant to hit the character, not me. Ah. Silk flowers exhibit different properties based on how their environmental conditions eh. differ from their ancestral habitat. Nevertheless, these are fine specimens, excellently preserved. Oh? Just look at the abundant foliage here. And these stamens, 
glamorous as a maiden of the Golden House. This strain is an evergreen, <laughs> and mostly grows under complex hydrological conditions. That's a lot of fancy words to say he does a good job raising flowers. By contrast, this variety thrives in any dark, damp location, often in large clusters. Morphologically, it is distinguished by the profusion of petals and densely they packed stamens, though its powerful scent gives it away just as easily. Seriously, damn good boys on this guy. Lastly, this strain is quite the recluse. Eh. Unlike its exuberant cousins, flowers and foliage are minimal, and when in season, it has a subtle yet enduring scent. It was first discovered by the ancients when they scaled the mountains in search of the Adepti. A <laughs> uh, hunter? Oh, you want to do... Ah, sorry, I'm not going to be doing co-op, mostly because I just like playing the game solo. It's fun. I probably want to do co-op one of these times, but it's one of those things I just got to get to the point where I feel good about it. I'm way too weak right now. Silk flowers have all but disappeared from the wild today oh. due to geographical changes over Liu's history. Most are not grown by so horticulturists. The ones I've been picking, I shouldn't have. Oops. Wow, a true connoisseur. Still want to punch you. Most of that was news even to me. And you probably should have just shut up and said nothing. I possess but a smattering of trivial knowledge. My traveler friend is the one to watch. They are on track to set foot in every corner of the world. Should we probably tell him that the Fatui kind of betrayed him? Might be helpful information. Ignoramus. You know, I'm just gonna go with this one oh, and feed his ego. Zhongli, you're way too humble. And Paimon fell so for it. So which silk flower did you want anyway? Really? I'll take them all, boss. No. Again? How can I put this? When purchasing opera tickets, it is natural to decide based on which singer has the most melodious voice. The same logic applies when purchasing a pet bird. You're just bullshitting us every step of the way. He's a freaking con artist. And Paimon, I, I'm actually disappointed in her. But this silk flower purchase is not an analogous case. Then you case. were wasting the metaphor! The same logic does not apply. Mm. Perhaps you don't know. Tradition states that we should decoct perfume from different subspecies of silk flower when making an offering to a statue of the Seven. Rex Lapis will then make his own choice between the scents. Except he did! Like oh several God. other tedious and complicated traditions, this one has become simplified over time. <laughs> but this is the only too. rite of parting to take place for one of the seven in 3,700 years. As such, I do think we should honor tradition down to the last detail in this case. Huh. Interesting that you know the tradition of how to pardon them or to say goodbye to them. Even though, you know, it has been... 3,000 years! Just saying! It's like, you're not hiding you're the Geo Archon. You're really not. Yeah. Now, that's settled. A question. A Call that revenge. <clears throat> Do you have any Mora on you? I think Mihoyo, just to screw around with people, should make Zhongli free. It's like, hey, he's broke. He's freaking broke. You have to pay everything for him. So he's free. You forgot to bring money again? <sighs> Zhong Li. I said it's a pattern emerging. Uh, if I may interject, did I hear you say that these flowers are to be an offering to the Lord of Geo himself? Oh, my God. I just... <sighs> and Pybro says he's our sugar daddy. Oh, God. No, I think in this case, we are, we're the sugar daddy in this case, and he's just siphoning off all the money. Oh, God. Yes, Ugh. in a sense. Yeah, offerings to him. Technically, he's standing right there trying to bilk you and us. Gosh, well, why didn't you say so? I heard the awful news about what happened at this year's Rite of Dissension. Yeah, shit, what's... Is there a bug in the... There's a fly in here, son of a... 
God, a sudden, like, buzzing sound by the ear it scared the shit out of me, man. Oh, God, I can feel my heart going. That's, uh... <laughs> well, I'm definitely awake now. It would be bad luck to say it out loud, but I've been worried about our so dear you Lord quiet ever because since. Of that, huh? Yeah, sure. I'm worried that everything I've heard is true. It is. He's dead. We're probably working for the guy who killed him. Uh, since these there. flowers will be used to glorify our Lord, they're free of charge. Just don't forget to pass on my regards. To the dead guy. Sure. Are you serious? Why wouldn't I be? I would be nobody if not for Rex Lapis. What? I don't get this. Why are they all... Oh, yeah, because the gods, they attribute everything to him. If he, he hadn't something. written those poems in praise of my wares, they'd only be worth a fraction of what I can sell them for today. You poems about it? Oh my god, the entire city is propped up by celebrity. Huh. huh. I mean, so much yeah. folklore here revolves around Liyue's deity making cameo appearances in support of local businesses. This is actually a very real thing they're talking about right now. The celebrity effect is a legitimate thing. Um, if you, for instance, have... Uh, what was it? Years ago on Twitter, Ashton Kutcher talked about a bakery that he went to. It's just a random thing. Wasn't even a sponsor post. He just did it. And immediately the bakery was overwhelmed with orders and requests and calls because he mentioned it on Twitter. This is actually a very real effect in business. This is actually a real thing. And I'm kind of amazed that they're even bringing it up because like all the things that, you know, the definitely not Archon is bringing up are just really cool in-game bits of lore. But this right here is a legitimate business practice to have someone prop up a business through name recognition due to celebrity endorsement. It's a real thing, and I'm kind of amazed. Thank you, boss. I think I speak <laughs> for all of us when I say that your generosity has saved our skins. Because we weren't paying for you. Our skins? You were the one who forgot to bring money! Also, I spent all the more I had on weapons and leveling up, so... Uh, <laughs> couldn't if I wanted to. Please, it's the least I could do. No, the least you could have done is a lot more, so we're not going to say anything. The least you could have done would have been nice. <laughs> You're an asshole, though. So, Pay us. now that we've got the flowers, how do we make the perfume? Who do we have to pay now? Ideally, with the help of an expert. Unfortunately, none of my acquaintances have personal experience in the art of decoction. Mmm. Do we have to go back to the wine place? Talk about first world Very problems. similar, although it's more taste and smell. Although they are connected senses. Hence, I need you to help by asking around in the city. Try the common folk, especially women. What? So we need to try the women? I think you might want to rephrase so that. So this time we get to go around town looking for nice-smelling ladies to talk to? Paimon likes this job. Oh my, Paimon. I never would have guessed. I will wait for you near the Statue of the Seven. <laughs> Meet me there when the perfume is ready. God. So I'm guessing this is the perfume lady. I'm probably going to have to change the title of this one, but... Oh, God. Maybe we can find some good candidates at the Adventurer's Guild. Sure, why not? I'm going to change the name <gasps> right now. She's here. master of the Leeway branch, right? What? Yeah, sure. I don't regret what I'm about to change the title to. Just putting it out there. I regret nothing. Nothing at all. Except my sense of taste. You can't beat the atmosphere well, here. Well, lack of taste. Of I have no taste. Just wondering what people are going to say when they see the new title. Also, yeah, Paimon being pervy. Things I was not expecting. Pervmon. <laughs> oh, God. Let's play. Who needs stairs? Vlad, why are you over here? I thought you were somewhere else. I think he mentioned it was cold here. Ah. Uh, 
You do realize you're off at the time she's not working, so you just go see her, but okay, sure. It's like they're not progressing forward without a main quest. <laughs> oh, God. And Spence Dog just says, Bad Dave. <laughs> Accurate. <laughs> so I'm thinking I'm mispronouncing the name. It's actually Spank Dog. I keep adding the E in there. Unless it's supposed to be pronounced that way, I'm actually not butchering it by butchering it. I'm, I'm butchering the butcher of butcherings? I'm overthinking this. I can't believe the well -gone. So who am I supposed to... Also, this lady is weird. Hey there. Don't be shy. Just throwing it out there. So where's this perfume lady? How did he stand on that? Okay. So Hans, the majority of NPCs in Leo are either horny, sad, or dead. Yeah, that actually makes a lot of sense. Yeah. So. Len, we need to ask you for a favor. Oh, that was Len. Still used to the Wheel of Time stuff. <laughs> I stopped accepting commissions a long time ago. What? Sorry, you too, but you'll just have to ask another adventurer. What? Oh, no. It's not that kind of favor. It's just a teeny tiny thing. <laughs> oh god, I want to say this one. Wow. Just wow. <laughs> She's not into it? <laughs> I'm just going to assume that you're either joking or being sarcastic. A little bit of both. To be fair, I put a lot of effort into my appearance for someone who spends all their time in the great outdoors. But I smell great. Don't be ridiculous. Well, Paimon thinks you smell amazing. So come on, Lon. What's your secret if not oh perfume? Oh, God. Ludes? What's loads? Oh. Yep, girl, I just got what you meant. Now that you mention it, yes, there is something. What is that scent? Are you smelling yourself, oh, lady? it must be from the Qingxing flowers I picked on the way back. I forgot I still had him with me. Oh. Aha! The truth is out. Lon's got a soft spot for wildflowers. Paimon's flirting. Oh uh, my. No, they were for medicinal use only. Uh huh. I think we've all been aware of what that phrase means. Anyway, this is a pointless conversation. <laughs> if you want to know about perfume, try talking to Chi Ming. Chi Ming? The fortune teller, right? Yet. Paimon remembers she smells pretty good. Have we met her? Oh my. And people are just going, Ara Ara intensifies. Thanks, Lon. See you around. What? Have I talked to this person and just not noticed? Oh yeah, I've passed by her a few times. The fortune teller. Hello. How may I help? We've yep. come to ask you a question. Doing it again, doing it again. Uh, I... Sorry, you caught me off guard. Most people aren't so direct. I'm not most people. I think we need more time to get to know each other. Oh god, she's not... <laughs> she's okay with it. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, we just wanted to know what perfume you normally use. <laughs> oh, um... <laughs> Well, I don't actually use any. Huh? That said, some of the cosmetics I use are scented. That's the thing. Perhaps that's the cause of this confusion. Might be. Since I usually set up my stall by the docks, I avoid perfume like the plague. Oh. Because Celestia forbid those lusty sailors catch a whiff and come hunting for the source. Also, I think she's the first person to reference Celestia who wasn't an Archon. Huh. Also, wow, lady. That's the worst thing Paimon's heard all day. Really? That's the worst thing? Deicide didn't have anything to do with it? Really? Okay, yeah, sure. While we're on the subject, have you never heard anyone mention Ying Ar's homemade perfume? Who's this perfume lady? Is it her or is it someone else? Ying Air? Oh, as in scent of spring Ying Air? What? Yes, that's her. Many a rich family's daughter has gotten her to make perfume for them. Apparently, her homemade product is better than anything you'll find on the market. 
Great. How does Paimon already this know this person? This is just the intel we need. Finally, we're getting somewhere. Uh huh. Also, I hope if I choose the pervy option the entire time, there's like a little bit of dialogue where the main character gets known as like some kind of perv in the city. Spear go. Whee! Where'd the dog go? Huh, that was weird. Oh, it ran off! No, doggo! I can't pet doggo. Also, I'm wondering, like, why is there just that one hole in the mountain right there? It seems really intentional for some reason. Oh, hey, there's stairs. See, I don't usually know how to move around the city. I usually just use uh, Venti to fly. Is it a good reason? Yeah, actually, I think it is. I'm okay with that one. So, I need to move here. Oh, nope, still going the wrong way. I'm able to do this. Oh, this lady. Is she the perfume lady? Well, hello. You found me at last. I've been waiting for you. What? What? How did you know we were coming? Oh, I heard a rumor about a couple who were snooping around town looking for a sweet-smelling lady. Actually, I was starting to worry you wouldn't find me. This is the ultimate test of my appeal, after all. What? Snooping around? Why are you making it out like we're bad people? I mean... What can I say? People love to talk. Maybe you ought to be more discreet in the future if you don't want word to get around. Ah! Because I talked to this lady earlier. She's the one who was talking about the bread and was really explicit. Relax. I know why you're here. You want to get your hand on my homemade perfume, don't you? What kind would you like? A bespoke triple silk flower variety. Oh! Okay, so one, we go with the actual one. Two, we go with this one. I'm just going to screw uh, Zhai Liang, or Zhao Long. I cannot speak today. So I'm going to go with this one. <laughs> I'm not wearing any, darling. Phrasing! Could it be that you've been bewitched by my natural scent? If so, I'm afraid it's one of a kind. Wow. <sighs> Whatever this is, you guys need to snap out of it right now. <laughs> I the silk flowers. Oh my god, Paimon got annoyed. <laughs> Three in one go. My goodness. Really, game? Really? Seriously, how is that line? That, oh, oh, wow. That line... They had to know when they recorded that that would be a misused line. Oh, oh my god, the aura aura intensifies. You have extreme tastes for someone your age. Maybe the rumors I heard were true after all. You're on the prowl and need some sweet smelling ammunition. Is that it? Oh, yeah, sure. I'm just going to run with this one. Ay, ay, ay. Who let this tiger out of the cage? Well, with your looks, who can blame you? Oh, God. You got it. Flaunt it. <laughs> oh, God. This lady's getting taken to horny jail. <laughs> As one of my favorite poems goes, O oh, cherry tree, begrudge not thy Definitely blossoms for the as they are deflowered in the spring. For come winter, even thy sturdiest wood shall wither. Oh. Oh, my. That went over Paimon's head a little. Oh, you're right, it would. <laughs> In short, I'm happy to help. Damn, Traveler, they're having a lot of explicit uh, But you'd better make sure I'm the only person on your mind while you're hanging around with me. Oh my. So, where is a good place for making sweet, sweet perfume? <laughs> I'm... You know what? Yo, I'm going to throw up the kitchen on this one because, yeah, we're doing that. I'm sure she wouldn't mind. You mean one mean restaurant? Good choice. Let's go. She's o surprisingly okay with this one. Oh, my. Um. Also, apparently, oh, my Discord has loads the being attached about that lady. Oh, my. Oh, would gliding be faster? 
Am I going the wrong way? I'm going the wrong way. So is Jean Ling here? We're just gonna go bug her? Okay, I guess we're not. Oh, her name is Ganger? Oh god. I've had a word with Chef Mao. We can start work now. Are you ready to please me? Someone has to make a super cut of all her lines just to sound horrible. What did you say? And <laughs> Paimon caught it. Oh my I god. meant make me proud as my assistant. Yeah, assistant. sure. That's exactly what she didn't mean. Well, I'm setting up. <laughs> you can go and fetch some water. There's a joke about wet here. Apparently, it's a status effect you can apply to people. Also, it needs to be done. I have now applied the status effect wet. It's super effective. <laughs> Try something new at the Wan Min restaurant. Job suing. Wow. Where do I Mayor fetch some water? Really okay, behind. Yeah, move lady. You're in my way. I'm pulling a Batman. People must have iron stomachs. Can I open this? No. Or did I already get this? I must have already got it. Oh, they just walked around. <laughs> Yay, water! <laughs> you do not walk well, do you? Job <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> this water will do nicely. Now, I need you to extract the silk flower essence using a crafting bench. Oh, my. Perfume making uses an altogether different technique from alchemy. In the other Here, translations? let me teach you. Very carefully, take hold of the mortar and pestle. Gently does it. I am so glad I have headphones on and my wife can't hear this. <laughs> oh, God. You need to keep your wrist firm so your hand doesn't slip. Now use your strong hand to stir it with a persistent rhythm. Keep going until the juices start to come out. Oh my god! Ooh, you're a natural, like a fish to water. I want to get a recording of this, just the audio of her talking, and just play it without any image from my wife, because, um... <sighs> Fuck, man. Now take these and try it out on your own using a nearby crafting bench. Don't forget to do all three. They look visually identical during the essence extraction process, but I will put them into separate containers when the perfume is ready. I don't trust myself to speak right now. <laughs> oh, wow. Excuse me. Apparently I need more coffee. Well, I'm going to have to use Lisa. It's the only thing with enough Ara Ara right now. Oh, God. Whee! One done. Two done. Three done. Oh, wow. Ah, oh, crap. Luke got all wet. Wow, this is some exquisite silk flower essence. Just, On to the next oh stage, God. the most important one of all. I hope no one finds my wife's Facebook page and posts this. Oh, God. The essence is placed into water and simmered over a low heat until most of the water has boiled off. Huh? You must take care to control the heat during this process. If the temperature goes too high, it will affect the scent. So oh please, my. focus on controlling the heat. Don't make this it is too the hot. final Got it. step. Don't waste a drop of that essence now. We want all of it in there. Oh, God damn! How did they get away with this? Already, and you, my friend, were a wonderful assistant. A 
testament to the lengths you will go to for romance. It's so rare to see nowadays. I'm just gonna play this one straight. Wow, you actually remembered my throwaway comment. <laughs> you know, you're cuter than people give you credit for. If I didn't have my Edge. guard up, I can see how easily one could be taken in. Also, I I'd like to point out, that is really a front-handed slap. It's not even a compliment, it's a front-handed slap. Hot damn. Anyway, shall I give you a brief overview of each scent? It might just help you match the right scent to the right occasion. Oh my god. Paima wants to hear this. This first one is sweet as candy, straight out of a fairy tale. Younger women will love it. What about older men who have no money? I think that's who we're making it for, right? Oh my god. First one is sweet. The second one is for those with more refined tastes. The first choice for daughters of high society. Mm hmm. So, first is sweet, second is refined. Finally, the third one has a soft but lingering scent, like a mist that captures the last light of dusk. Mature women adore this one. So it's sweet, refined, and mature. Got it. All clear? Don't get them mixed up now. You'll ruin the mood. Good. Be sure to come visit if you ever need help with anything, okay? I'll leave you with some parting words. Oh no, oh no. One who tries to sail three boats simultaneously should be careful not to go overboard. Freezing! <laughs> Come and hang out with me at Scent of Spring sometime, okay? Let's take these three perfumes over to the Statue of the Seven! Mr. Zhongli's probably been waiting a while. They got away with this! I mean, I just... There is legitimate <laughs> off-brand that isn't this explicit. <laughs> like, I am legitimately surprised they got away with this. Yahoo! <laughs> oh, I don't think I made this jump right. Oh, there was a path I could have followed. Oh well. Mm -hmm. I exactly meant to do it that way. Yeah. <sighs> Seriously though, guys, that was... I feel I need to censor this! I, it's completely safe for work, but it is in no way, shape, or form safe for work. Where am I heading? Oh, I'm... Oh, we're going to that one. Yeah, okay. Honestly, I would... Thought we'd go to the other statue, but okay. Yeah, sure. Oh, just get a little coffee to relax, and I still have coffee. Good. At this point, I should probably mention, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, because, um, I might be on the couch for the next few days after this stream. Yeah. And please, if anyone knows, let me know in Discord if, um, if the translations in other languages are nearly as explicit. Yeah. Hmm. I wonder who the Geo Archon is. <laughs> Let's play. Apparently, he didn't like wearing a shirt. Had hair right in front of his face. Can I see anything else? Hmm. And he had some kind of badge on his front. I wonder who that would be. I mean, if only we knew some random guy who was about that size with hair draping right in front of his face. And he had a similar brooch as a symbol on his back. No idea. It's a complete mystery. We've brought the perfumes, Mr. Zhongli. Mm -hmm. Did we take too long? 
You were just staring up at the statue. <laughs> hey, production, what's up, man? Thanks for dropping in. Where do you prefer is at? <laughs> oh, God. Uh, oh, you're back. Don't worry, I haven't waited long. Yeah, we were kind of busy being... Unless he was, like, sexually assaulted, honestly. Oh, God. <sighs> Ooh, yeah, is that you do live streams of the game, too? Yeah, you know what I'm going through right now. It's, um... I feel like I should have done that in free time without someone watching it. It's, it's, um, wow. Compared to the watch that Rex Lapis's statues have kept over Liu, this was but a brief moment. Uh-huh. <laughs> well, how can a person compete with a statue? That is true. Well, have you brought the perfumes? Three sets, and not one less. Oh, God. Thank you both. Let us offer them up. Honestly, Sion, if it wasn't actually him, that would be a huge twist at this point, because they're kind of lining it up to exactly as him being the Geo Archon. It would be kind of hilarious. This is the first kind of perfume. Miss Yinger said that it's sweet as a dream, and it's liked by younger ladies. Oh my god, I love this. <laughs> I love how we're redefining it for this one. This is the second kind. It's got an elegant smell. This and is the so awkward for him. I love this. Love it. The third kind has a gentle I hope but makes lingering feel as uncomfortable fragrance. As I was watching all of that. Something, something like the dusk mist. And it's a favorite of mature ladies. Apparently the statue approves. Oh, what was that? I guess the final answer is number three. He likes going for the mature crowd. That's the one older ladies like, right? So, like, Baido or Ningwa? Okay, I don't think I mind. Does that mean that Rex Lapis is actually an older lady? <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps. Perhaps. <laughs> He's not even denying it. Rex Lapis has taken on countless forms. Perhaps that really was one of them. Oh, my. What a shame. We only got to see the giant dragon form, and... Uh, why did you pause? <sighs> Let's hope the cheese thing can catch the real killer. <laughs> God. We can leave that to the authorities. Let us focus on the fond farewell for Rex Lapis. I am very curious about the ulterior motives. So, we finished another step in our preparations. What's next? Hmm. Also, pre... I remember there was that one world quest talking about how two gods met here and one disappeared. I wonder if this is the other god who they talked about. And maybe the Geo Archon actually was Rex just taking multiple forms and this guy just stuck around. Huh. Next, I would like the two of you to help me borrow the cleansing bell. What? Also, then there's the entire thing about how, uh, how to put it. This entire world is probably just some kind of robotical construct. Cleansing bell? At present, a friend of mine named Madam Ping is the guardian of the cleansing bell. You have friends? She lives near Yujing Terrace. If you ask her... How much did you bilk her for? She will know what to do. Sure, but aren't you going to come with us? Ah. Make himself useful. I have that, certain no. reasons why I cannot be there in person. You Please, stole from her, right? do this for me. I wonder what thing he could have possibly Man, done to get away from the scam. why's he gotta be so secretive this time? Oh, God. Scam artist. It's a thing. Ooh. Looks like we're at the part where we need to do that thing. Ooh, it's almost 2 o'clock. Oh, no. All right, so that's the next big step. I think right now I might need to call this one here. Uh, because holy shit, man, that was, um... <sighs> um, hi, love. Uh, I, I definitely haven't been doing anything that might be in, uh... <laughs> uh, my wife is awake now and she's not sleeping anymore and I need to be very careful what I say. Um, yep, she's just playing... Oh, she was awake the entire time. She was just playing Animal Crossing. This thing. Yep. 
I'm right I'm now, I wish I was sitting at the quiet. top of a tree, looking out Love over a meadow, cider in hand. <laughs> <sighs> oh, God. I love my wife. <laughs> Just gonna grab this before I do anything else. E. Also, I wonder if I've got the quest to do the upgrade. There's that. There's the quest. Very strong aura aura. The realm within. Did I just say realm instead of realm? Wow. Also, Black Cliff Woes and Time and the Wind. I keep getting references to that one. Need to do this one still. The Chasm. Oh, yeah. That one. Yeah, I need to do that. Uh, Claremont, resin caps out at 120. Yeah, it does. So basically, I just do one or two random a day and just ignore the rest. It usually works out pretty well. <sighs> All right, guys. This is where I got to call this one. Interesting pose you have there, Venti. So all the same, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one when I definitely don't do anything um, nearly as incriminating. Yeah. <laughs> I'll see you guys later. Adios. <laughs> oh, there's an us. I didn't just lose that. Nope. Oh, God. <laughs>